Amy here and I would like to show you two ways that you can recover files from your Time Machine backup. Here we go. Assuming that you have a Time Machine backup and everything has been backed up properly, then you can go back and recover any files that you may have thrown away on your Mac currently. So um, today I'm looking for a file called list of classes that used to be on my desktop and I can't find it. So I'm going to open up my time machine backup and find that file. Now there are two ways that you can navigate your time machine backup. So first off, my time machine backup is usually, you can see it on the desktop. Um, I actually have two. Um, and let's see, most people just have one. So I'm looking at this backup right here. Um, you can also find your backup disk in the sidebar in your finder under locations. So we're going to see the backups drive right here in the sidebar. It has to be plugged in. If it's not plugged in or if it is plugged in and it's not showing up, you can unplug it, plug it back in, and then you'll see it up here in the sidebar or on the desktop. Once you open up your backup folder, so I did that by just double clicking on the backup itself or any finder window when I open it up and then navigate to the backup on the sidebar, that's gonna get me into that folder. I can see all of my backups going back in time. So what I would like to do is to find a backup prior to today um, when I knew that I had the file. So I know that I had it here yesterday, um, but I didn't have it today. I, I threw it away at some point in between. So I wanna go back to a date that I, I'm pretty sure the file was present. So to do that, I'm looking at the last backup date. That was um, the last one done yesterday. I'm double clicking on the backup drive and then inside the backup drive, you're gonna see a hierarchy exactly like your hard drive. So in there, you're double clicking your hard drive and then your users folder. I basically am navigating to where the file used to be. So it used to be right here on my desktop and in my backup drive, I want to go to my backup, or sorry, to my desktop folder in my backup from yesterday. So I'm going to my username. I went to users and then my username. And now I'm going to go to the desktop folder. And we can see there was actually a lot of stuff on my desktop yesterday. So I did a lot of cleaning up. And the one that I'm looking for is called list of classes. So I'm just gonna scroll through. I'm gonna click to sort these by name. And here it is, it's actually here. Um, in this circumstance, I'm just gonna click and drag and put it right back on my desktop. So now it's back where it was yesterday. And that's one way to recover. The other way you can do that is I'm just gonna delete this again and we're gonna recover it again another way. The other way is to enter your time machine. And if you have uh, your time machine backup turned on and you have the shortcut in your top menu bar, there's an option called enter time machine. So this is gonna give me a different view. So now it's gonna show me my desktop and then it's going to show me a snapshot of my desktop for each of the dates that it backed up. So I can see today I do not have list of classes here. I'm going to go back to the last time it was there. So there it is. Yesterday at 436 it was there. So I can select it and click restore and that puts it back on the desktop for me. If you have any other questions, please book an appointment at mymacmentor.com or reach out to us by email at hello at mymacmentor.com. Thanks.